party. Come here. Arr. I confess, I be needing your help. Just in time, my dear Lachance, wind of my heart sail has been captured. It's that thieving pirate lord, Long Bronzed Gilbear. I aim to run him through with a rusty cutlass, but alas, he wears the most potent protection, the Chance's plot armor. After Gilbear sweet talked his way onto our boat last night, he stole the Chance away and vanished. Must have been using that sea sorcery that's so popular here on the island. Go talk with the local witch doctor. We'll have to fight fire with fire. Plot armor is precious booty. No man can die when wearing it, so the legends go. But somehow, Gilbert pried the armor off my chance. Unless he... No, he had to have used some magic devilry. The witch doctor's an old friend. Her magic's helped me out of many a sea pickle, which is like a sea cucumber, but even brinier. Looking for a witch doctor, that you? Damned sea witches. That be she, but she be asleep, or in a trance, or a sleep trance. Find a way to wake her from her witchy slumbers. Wakey, wakey! Well, blow me down! That trunks me deeper than a sunken semiotician! But have no fear! There's a cannon not far that you might commandeer! Short a course! Welcome to Yes We Cannon! Here for all your cannon needs! If you need something louder, we've got the powder! Uh, care to give it a blast, me lord? D? Oh, very quaint, don't you agree, me lordy? Yeah, sure. Uh, does it come in, you know, big kid sizes? I need something loud. You know, boom, boom. <laughs> oh, you just sorry shot! The lordy wants it louder! Bring her down below and swap her up with something what kicks proper! Let's show him what the far mountain clan can do! At the ready! Well, if that's the biggest you've got, then that's fine, I suppose. But something tells me you can do better. But the dragon cannon is forbidden. Ever since it woke the dragons of the far mountain in the last age. Oh, is that all? Come on, then. Very well. Dragon cannon... Dragon cannon hoist! Right, you dogs! Raise hoy that elder boar from which all worldly sorrows were shot. Today, we rouse the hells themselves. As if this exciting. Put your backs and do it, you sorry spineless Saxon sword! Don't keep the customer waiting all day! Just a moment more, I'm sure. Pull her up faster! The Lord is dying old age up here! I am so sorry, me lordy, dear new cannon. At the ready, me lordy. All right, I'm awake. Wait, uh, I'm awake? Ugh! Who woke me from my very death like but definitely alive trance? Ugh, stupid cannons again! <laughs> That's got to be the second loudest cannon I've ever heard! Oh, what's so bloody important that I couldn't get a little shut-eye? I need you to tell me how to destroy some plot armor. No oh. need to know why. I'm trying to kill a guy wearing it. Damn. Uh, whatever. Can you help? Destroy plot armor? Impossible! 
Unless you're a cunning witch doctor like myself. I can't destroy it per se. But the curse of true character could turn a crusty coward into a smaller creature. And the armor would fall right off. Well, then again, they might transform into a vicious giant monster. Well, depending on their character. Either or. Oh, great. So, uh, how do we do this wee slash giant beastie curse thing, then? Tell you what. Meet me at the Ravenous Caverns, and we'll put the curse together. Together! It's a good thing you arrived when you did. A coven of coils showed up at my hut the other day, claiming my magic cauldron for their own. We'll reclaim it soon. But we need the proper ingredients first. She has. Comrades and concubines of long bronze steel bear they are. Bones! So it's you who wants to destroy some plot armor. Didn't Lachance own some? I thought you two were flotsam bound together in a foamy sea of love. Aye, we are now and always will be. But the chance has been kidnapped, and his plot armor sits on the burly chest of Long Bronze Gilbert. I won't rest till my love is in my arms and my blade in Gilbert's gut. Now we'll harvest the materials for the curse in this hex caster. Now we'll need to collect curse essence from some sorry cursed souls. Head to the grave of the bone picked pirate. They made the mistake of spending a night in these haunted caves, only to be eaten alive by cursed crabs. Now they too share the curse, transforming to their true crabby form when they grow weak. Summon them with the caster, and when they transform, put them out of their misery. We'll use their salty essence to make the curse. I didn't always trust the witch doctor so, but she's never... Now place the hex caster and watch it work its magic. He's transformed! Now slay him and gather his gooey essence! Not a chance! so skilled at crushing crustaceans well done but to complete the curse i'll need my cauldron i'll meet you at the beach near my hut but beware those coiled crones have given more sailors peg legs than the diamond sword dagger scissor reefs and prepare the curse! So I might look upon their killer. Who 
Whoever you are, you handsomely mysterious murderer, you'll be joining the ranks of my undead crew once we make you dead first, that is. <laughs> adventure. Are you still a practitioner of the sea sorceress arts? Would you be asking for my help if I wasn't? Now you, drop the curse essence into the cauldron. Ah, oh, tis a powerful kindness you do me. A thousand thanks. Well done, witch doctor. And you, me hearty. Whatever your name or profession may be. Now to Long Bronze Gil Bear's cave to rescue La Chance. We better get a move on. We've had a long walk, followed by a longer swim. He can swim, can't he? Bones, I'm insulted. Let me just whip up a portal for you. <laughs> You've been with Lachance for many moons, Bones. Why haven't you made him your first mate for life? Tis a fair question, witch doctor. And after Long Bronze Gilbear sinks to the salty deep and the chances <laughs> I just Mike Now try to parlay. No more blood needs to be shed, unless that blood be the blood of Long Bronzed Gilbert. Parlay! Excuse me. Uh, parlay. G got a uh, parlay to get to. Just, just gonna do a quick little parlay with the captain, if, if that's all right. I doubt. That's not a problem, is it? Parley, may I ask then, what is the nature of this proposed chat with Captain Gilbert? Parley, need to tell him to hand over La Chance, or I'll do something terrible and violent. Parley, that seems like a threat. I thought we were parleying. Maybe learn some manners, you know? No way we're letting you in with that barbaric attitude. Damn the ancient and subtle code of Parley! Pirate law protects these scallywags, so we can't just fight through. I seem to recall spending a lot of time and effort collecting curse juice or something. Would that work here? Brilliant! That just might work! Sea creatures probably aren't under the purview of pirate law. Hit them with a hexy! It worked! Look! Their characters made conspicuous by their cowardly carapaces! Now, kill those cute crabs! Seize it, P.T. Time for a spell! That was a close one. We almost broke pirate law. We might have had to suffer through... 
through pirate court, a pirate fine, or even pirate community service. Now to finally kill that beguiling Gilbert and free my lovely the chance. Onward! Lucky you. Page, baby. Have you heard of the pirate lass whose ship was so fine as she passed? Did you like that poem? You can hear the rest of it at the tavern in Brightburn. Darling, 
You've got to stop Gilbert. I... Oh, I, I don't know how much longer I can weather this storm. Come, me hearty. The murdering bastard's on his ship, making ready to flee. <laughs> here who'd like to see you. Bones! Can you hear me, Bones? The chance! My love, you're... you're free! Free and waiting for you? You always come for me, Bonesy, and sure is the tide. Here you are! Oh, the chance! But I'm a skeleton, and ye be not but ether. We can't truly be together. Unless, unless me matey here uses some sea sorcery. Me hearty, hex me. Sure, whatever floats your pirate boat. If you want to be sushi, who am I to stop you? Sure is sure. Once I'm a fearsome giant crab, I'll pop right out of me plot armor. And then ye can unmoor my ghostly spirit from my corporeal bonds. and complicated sea sorcery ritual. Well, don't just stand there talking about it. Get me spirit out of here, uh, if you please. Sure thing, Bones. Hold still. Bippity badonka bum! It worked! At long last, I'm free of that cursed bony prison. Oh, Bones. You're just as beautiful as the day we met. I love. When I'm with you, I'm the luckiest pirate in all the seas. I'd give up all the nautical debauchery in the world for just one more. The chance. Oh, Bones. You're a terrible scoundrel. <laughs> Yar, and don't ye forget it, love. As for you, crew. I bequeath to ye me chest of worldly plunder. We won't be needing it where we're going. Tis all yours, me hearty. Now come see us away. Tis terrible luck starting a journey without a proper send-off. Oh, numbers. My favorites are the big ones. Well, usually I say stay safe, but you're both already ghosts, so... Have fun on your voyage, I guess. What? Voyage? <laughs> but where to? We have no chart. 
I don't need a map to know we're bound for adventure, dearest. Let's get away from all this. Away, chance away. We'll go away together. Away, chance away. We'll far away. 